I'm gonna make a spinach, apple, carrot, ginger, lemon and lime and avocado smoothie. I'm gonna juice the spinach, the apples, the carrots and the ginger uh, and then I will squash in by hand a little bit of lemon and lime juice, not try and juice the skin. I won't put the whole lemon and lime in. Uh, and then I'm gonna blend in the avocado, maybe some banana too in the Bartek 435. So I'm gonna get started now. We're using the greenish uh, F9010 vertical slow juicer. I've been using this one for a little while now. Um, we went from using it on test because uh, it was so accomplished. Uh, it's been my main juicer for quite some time now. There are much more expensive juicers out there, um, but uh, we've found this one doing the job really well. Nice cold pressed juice, nice dry pulp. Vertical slow juicer means it just swallows everything up easily. Does a really good job on the leafy greens too. Got a nice effective auger in it. Um, does everything I want it to do. I'm going to show you some of this nice cold pressed juice gushing out of the juicer now. As we're juicing some carrots. I'll show you the gravity assisted feeding that you get. Okay, here's our little trick to juice the leafy greens effectively in a vertical slow juicer. Load them up, pop them in the juicer, follow them through with a couple of little pieces of carrot. Don't even need the pusher, and that will just push the leafy greens straight through. This is the juicer is finishing. You can see there the layering of the juice. That's the spinach juice on top of the carrot and apple and ginger. Um, that's the joy of cold press juicing. No aeration, nice high quality cold press. The thing we do with the vert is just pour a little bit of water into it at the end of the run. That'll run straight through the juicer, dislodge any pulp that's stuck in there, and just give you an easier cleanup. Next stage is nice fresh avocado into the blender. I generally use a whole one because I don't like an avocado to be going off in my fridge. I think a bit of skin went in with that. I'll sort that out. And there's the other half. Amazing food, avocado flesh. Amazing whole food, essential oils, fats, you name it. This is how I add lemon juice. It's as easy as that. Ooh, you can use a little Mexican press that will press out a little bit more, but I just do it by hand. Juice is in there, a banana and avocado is in there. A quick blend. Okay, if you don't mind the color, this smoothie has got vitamins, minerals, fiber, energy giving, boosting nutrients, the whole broad spectrum you can possibly need to keep your mind and body healthy.